Hey guys, this is Tom Long, film critic for the Detroit News. This is The Real Deal. What a great weekend for movies. We have two knockout movies. Couldn't be more different. Uh, the first one is WALL-E, the latest from Pixar. Um, by my judgment, the riskiest thing they've ever done, but also one of the absolute most satisfying, especially the first half of this film, is just cinema magic. Um, it's about a little robot who is left behind when uh, mankind has to leave Earth having put too much junk on it. Uh, the, whole, the whole planet is apparently just too polluted and too covered in crap and so mankind flies off into sp in spaceships and forgets this little robot who's kind of a trash compactor fellow. Um, years later, 700 years later, as man who has turned into this bulbous fat, you know, sloth of a thing, they all just live on spaceships that can't even walk anymore. In many ways, the movie's quite depressing. Um, man sends a, uh, a probe back to Earth to see if it's livable. The probe, the robot that they send back, and Wally link up, and it is a wonderful, wonderful adventure that they go on. It's got meaning, it's got an eco message. The, the real killer though is, like I say, the first half, which is virtually silent. There's no dialogue at all. And it's, it's a return to what made Chaplin and Buster Keaton so great years ago. I can't recommend this movie enough. If you have kids, go see it. If you don't have kids, go see it. I gave it an A. Uh, it was a total no-brainer. Wanted is the absolute other end of the spectrum. As hard an R as you're gonna get, You know how they say, someday a girl's gonna come along and change your world forever. You have no idea. A crazy, crazy action film about a average loser life cubicle kind of guy played by James McAvoy who is suddenly recruited to become a top hitman assassin for a, a network of assassins. He's mentored by Angelina Jolie. Has any woman ever looked more dangerous on screen? No. Um, this stuff is crazy, absolutely nuts. Um, as fast moving, inventive, and just plain violent as any action film as I've ever seen. Um, I loved it. I can see people being driven crazy by it though, so it depends what kind of film geek you are. If you like mad, mad action, totally over the top, you gotta see this movie. I gave it an A as well. So it's a good movie, it's a good weekend for movies, get out there and see them. See you next week.